Okay. Is that the uh, chair that you sit in to do your writing and, and agenting? Uh, the agenting, yeah. I write actually in a back bedroom, sitting on a bed um, and typing. I have, So I have complete separation. I have a writing room for the writing and I have my laptop computer all set up there. It's a separate computer and everything. Um, and it's a very Zen kind of space. I have, um, you know, a cherry tree, a uh, whole triptych of cherry tree set up on one and a lotus thing set up in a mandala. And it's just a very Zen space. Um, and that's where I do my writing. Um, and it's downstairs and then my office is upstairs and there I have a yoga ball chair and everything. And, and it's just, yeah, complete separation, different computers, different spaces. And I write first thing in the morning before agent me wakes up and is too critical of author me. <laughs> so I, it's funny, I talk about myself in two different personas and it kind of feels like that as well. I feel like this should be the start of the show because that's fascinating. You've got two separate spaces. And so that um, it's like the passes of a hypnotist watch, I imagine, when you get in there, like, okay, this is definitely why I'm here. Uh, there's no need to look at whatever the other me might look at during this time. I'm 100% focused on whichever persona's room I'm in. Yeah, yeah. And in fact, as soon as agent me like wakes up, like as soon as I start thinking about a letter I have to write to an editor or, oh, I have to get this done and this done and this done, then the writing time is just over. Um, creative me can't function anymore. I can't think of, of my novel and my stuff. Um, I, and then I, ha I have to just go up to the office and start my work day. So I have to try very hard um, to leave my phone in the other rooms that it doesn't alert that I have work emails or anything else. Um, and I say try very hard because I'm a workaholic. So I'm almost never out of uh, reach of my authors. I'm almost never off duty. That's why I write first thing in the morning. I try and write, like I said, before Agent Me wakes up, before Agent Me is on duty. So <laughs> what I do is I get up actually at um, 5 a.m. every morning and I go walking with my girlfriends. We walk all the way to the front of our complex and back. So we walk uh, over four miles every morning. And when we get back, I grab some coffee and I go straight to my writing room. And then I write. Um, and like I said, I'm sort of trying to beat the clock before my agent self comes on online. And as soon as, as soon as she comes online, it's all over. So that's, that's kind of how my day goes. Um, and then I'm up to the office as soon as my agent self is on the clock. And then I'm, I'm that for the rest of the day. So I, I can't write once that happens. Um, I can sometimes revise later in the day after my work day, but, but usually, usually it's all over once the agenting starts because then that doesn't shut off till I go to bed. And even then sometimes I'm writing letters to editors in my head. <laughs>